This is Hamilka uh, outside the left tackle. Watch how easily he gets his hands into this tackle, um, locks him out, watch his eyes, he's going to find the ball carrier, sets the edge uh, effectively with the tackle, uh, and then sheds, comes back, gets in on this tackle. Watch it again. like us to watch a couple things here. Watch how explosive he is off the football. Uh, watch him string together moves. Um, lefty quarterback here. And then watch the desire to get to the quarterback. Um, yeah, really, really explosive off the ball here. Um, sets up, gets the tackle to set outside. Then he works inside, powerful swat, gets those hands away, follows it up with a swim. And then he's making his way for the quarterback here. Um, yeah, you just see just a very, very gifted athlete. Probably get a flag for this in the NFL uh, for where he hits him. But you see just that explos uh, explosion off the line, uh, the ability to string pass moves together, and uh, what a powerful athlete he is. Watch it again. Another good example of how explosive he is. Um, off the ball. They haven't lined up at three tech here. Um, this ball is designed off the outside leg of the, the center here. Um, so the opposite A gap, he's lined up in B gap outside the, the uh, guard. Watch him drive the tackle all the way over to the opposite A gap and drop him into the lap of the tailback. Watch it again. Here he is off the left side, really nice feet at the line of scrimmage, uh, almost like a wide receiver getting off press. You see him work inside, get the tackle to commit inside right here. Um, he's going to find the quarterback uh, visually and watch him long arm right here. I think he's playing with real good uh, leverage. Watch him long arm this tackle and absolutely drive him. Now you see this a lot with him, this sort of one arm, long arm technique and then rip. Uh, he's got this very powerful one-arm rip there. You see it? He's able to jerk that tackle down and clear him. And you see the arm swim on the heels of that. So a nice rush uh, overall here. He gets the cleanup. Um, there's pressure off both sides and up the gut. But a lot of good things on this rush. Feet off the line of scrimmage. Very explosive. Gets the tackle to commit. Gets hands off of him. He's finding the quarterback. Just that nice press and long arm, and then this one-handed rip. Again, finding a quarterback, plants that foot, cuts inside, sheds, swims, and he's going to clean up. Watch it again. Oregon State has him lined up at three tech um, on third down. It's something the Ravens would do with Bowser and their outside backers a lot. Uh, standing. Watch it at full clip. Watch how fast his feet are and how deceptive he is at the line getting the uh, uh, guard here to set outside. Huh. And then a club and a swim and then that's all she wrote. There's a there's a late blitz there that the back picks up. Uh, watch the hands here. Once he gets him to commit outside, he's going to club with his outside arm, swim, beeline, finish. Uh, again, you can see how quick his feet are before he actually engages. Uh, at full clip. So here we go. Watch him. He does not make the play here, but I want to take a few plays and just watch his technique. He's at five tech here, and he's an engaged the tight end. Uh, he's in C gap. That's his gap. That's what it looks like to me anyway. Um, plays a very good pad level here. See him moving laterally, laterally down the line, engage, fully locks out there, sinks his hip, finds the ball carrier, and sheds right there. Nice, powerful hands to kind of rip and take that tight end away. Uh, and the back makes a, makes a nice cut inside. But really good technique uh, in terms of defending the run here. I believe they have him as a uh, Sam or, or Apex here. 
in a 4-3. This play picks up late. But again, watch him engage this tight end at the 27 and drive him out, uh, lock out, drive him back two plus yards, really into the path of this pulling guard. And you're going to see the, the uh, tailback take this inside. He's going to shed, come off and make the play. Watch it again. They do drop him. They do use him in, in uh, zone coverage and, and also covering uh, man from time to time. You see a pretty nice drop here where he, you can see him checking what's behind him. He's the hook to flat here, and he ends up taking the back. Not a terrific tackle here, a little bit high, uh, but you, at least you get a, get a look at him um, in, in a drop and then making a play in the open field. 